Less talking, more calls. I gotta call the number before it rings, you dumbass motherfucker. Come on, man. So, Rock Ace, y'all, this is Tommy. Tommy. Hello. Tom- Tommy? Yes. Yeah, I'm looking to get a couple Christmas gifts. A couple Christmas gifts? Yeah. Um, like what kind of Christmas gifts? What's that? I'm sorry? Say again? What are you what are you looking for? I'm trying to get some board games. Right, what games? Um let's see what do you have like for a man? What do we have here? What do you have a uh, board game for a man? What's it called? What do you have uh, for a man? I mean they're gender neutral. All of them are? You don't have any gender specific ones? No, they're pretty gender neutral. Okay. You don't have, like, that Eric Trump board game? No. Okay, you don't have that? No. You don't have Brexit the board game? What's it called? Brexit the board game? No, I don't think so. We have a very limited retail section, too. Okay. I could probably tell you what games I have quicker than you can ask me. Okay. People have been asking me to ask you for this specifically. Do I? People have been asking for me to tell you this specifically. They wanted to been forcing me to ask you about this Eric Trump board game. Donald Trump board game. No, it's Eric Trump actually. Oh, Eric Trump board game. No, we don't have it. You don't have. I've never it? heard of it. You never heard of it. You should no. be getting it. It's a pretty. It's a pretty popular item this season. I can let my manager know. What about Brexit, the board game? What's it called? Yeah, Brexit, the board game. Breadstick? Yeah, Brexit, the board game. No. Are you prank calling me right now, man? No, man. These are... You haven't heard of this? You haven't seen it on Facebook? No. Okay. Okay. (laughs) Well... She's pranking me now. The record, y'all. This is Tommy. Tommy, we just got disconnected. I had a couple other questions for you. Okay, what's up, man? Which are, man, that's kind of uh, not unprofessional. I, I'm a bartender. Okay, sir. Huh? Well, I'm trying to see what other board games you have there for Christmas. We're going to bring okay, some friends. So for, for sale, I have Sorry. I have Smash Up. I have Paton Rivals. I have... Chris. What about Kekistan Crush? Hello? No. What That's about, all the games that we have for sale. What about Frasier? I'm sorry? What about Frasier? No, I just told you all the games I have for sale. You don't have any other uh, f- physicist or Thank psychiatric you. related games? Any actual what? Do you have any gender specific psychiatric games? They're board games, man. They're not sexist. Yeah, but I want one for men with psychiatric overtones. I don't have anything like that. I'm sorry. You don't have Battletoads, the board game? Have what? Battleship? Battletoads. No, I literally just told you every game I have for sale. Why not? Why don't you have that? Are board games are board games different than card games, or are you loop, lumping them all together? I just told you all of my retail games. I have eight hundred to a thousand different titles in here that you can play in the in the bar, but I don't have many for sale. And all of the games that you told me, like Breadsticks, the board game, never heard of it. Why have you heard of it? It's pretty popular. I don't know, man. You don't have that. You don't have like the G- Gavin McInnes butt plug game. I just work here. Okay. I make Cosmos. You make Cosmos? Yes. Like this streamer? But I am working, so if there's not anything else I can help you with. I'm working, too. So let's work together on this. What do you say? Well, how about I pass you over to my manager? Because I have to make people drink, and I can't... Yeah, just go ahead any more games that don't, don't exist. Just don't drop the phone. and They do exist. I don't appreciate the... The insinuation there, you're being discriminatory, sir. 
Sir? Can I help you? Hi, how are you doing today? Uh, I'm okay. Well, um, my bartender just handed me the handed me the phone. I'm not really sure what's going on here. Yeah, I'm not sure either. Uh, I was just speaking with the young man about some board games, and we can't get anything figured out here. She's saying what I'm saying doesn't exist. And... Hmm. What 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 game is that? Yeah, it was uh, Eric Trump's adventure. Um, I it's not it's I I don't think that she meant to tell you that it doesn't exist. I think she was trying to tell you that we do not have it. I think she was being discriminatory, sir. And really? it makes that makes me a okay, little bit what, upset. Um, makes me a little bit what, upset. What, 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 what happened, sir? Well, she was saying things well, I'm saying don't exist. Maybe she's being she's treating me in a different way. She's being discriminatory and prejudiciary. Why do you, what did she say to, to make you feel that way, sir? She was saying that I, I'm gender, gender neutral, but I'm not. I'm a man and I'm, I'm bicurious, but doesn't mean I don't have my gender. Uh, excuse me? My bartender said that to you? Yes, yes sir. He absolutely oh, said that. Really? Yeah. Okay. Um, hold on one second, sir. Okay. So I don't know what we're going to do about this. I could put you on a three-way call with my attorney. No, I. Uh, I mean, I don't think. Uh, I would just like to hear uh, what, what you have to say. I don't think uh, that she'll be around if this. Uh, this happened. What? Um, okay, go ahead. What's your name? My name is Raul. Okay. Your last name? I don't want to give you my last name. What if she? If you? If you? If you're gonna discipline her, I don't want her looking me up on Facebook. Uh, well, I would not give her your name, sir. I, but she I was sounds like a to bit. Get uh, your name and contact information so that we could, uh, so that I, so that I can address this. And, well, if she uh, sounds like trouble when it's addressed. I don't know if you, if I want my name on any of your documents, especially while while she's working tonight. Now, if you, I can call back tomorrow with the rest of uh, my. My my name or something, but I really don't feel comfortable with that right now. Okay, I hope that, you understand. That, that's that's that, that's fine, sir. That's fine. If you so what's wanna, happening if you here? Give me a call in the morning. That's that's completely fine. But um, I, the thing is, I can't I, the, call tomorrow. I'm the that's why I'm general manager here, and I'd, I'd really love to get to the bottom. Okay, of Okay, well let's do it. Let's do it right now. Why don't you put her on the phone, and she can just apologize, and we'll call it good. Uh, well, I need to know what happened, sir. She was uh, being she, discriminatory. She, she's, she's very busy with customers at the moment. I, I, I'm just trying to figure out what happened. She just walked up to me and handed me the phone. I'm just trying to figure out what is going on. You said that she's been discriminatory and prejudiciary. I'm trying to figure out what she said that made you say that. I, I can't go make her apologize for something that I don't know what she said, sir. I'm just trying to figure out what happened. So, I and when I when I document these things, I I always just get everybody's information. But if you would like to just tell me what happened, or if you would like to call me back at a different time, I understand. But I I just want to know what's what's going on because if if what you're saying is true then I, I then I need to go handle it with my bartender and I believe that she was being discriminatory about my ethnicity it's quite quite racial so but, if you just put her on the phone what did she say sir to make you feel that way is I what just, is what I'm asking I can hear racial when I know it okay I uh, I'm I'm uh, just simply asking what what made you feel that she was being racial. What did she say? I mean, I'm assuming that she's she's not black. I don't mean to assume her, assume her racialness, but by her tone, I did, I kind of picked up on a colonizational tone. You know, it's colonizational. I could hear it in her tone. 
She's being discriminatory towards my ethnicity and is quite racial and prejudiciary. I, I'm you, still not. I, you don't I, believe me, okay, sir? Okay, but you don't are, me? Are you saying you're saying that it was simply in her tone? Well, it was I, in I'm, her tone and and her timbre as well. It was oppressional. I, I mean. I, are you victim blaming me, sir? No, I am not, sir. I'm simply trying to figure out what happened, and all I'm being told is that she had a tone. I mean, I, I, go ahead. I I, I, I want to handle this, but I can't fire her for having a tone when I don't know what was said. I don't know. I'm just trying to figure out what happened. I uh, um, I uh, I don't know why she would be racist over the phone and or why she would be racist at all i don't allow like it, it's uh, i would like to discipline her but i need like something to discipline her for she, her. she hung I'm up on to me figure out what what she did she hung up on me that's why i called back now i'm sure you hear that you heard the phone ring i'm sorry I got a little tongue-tied there. I'm just still shocked by the discriminatory practices I've been experiencing. She's talking to me about my gender and things like that. How did you get on that that topic? Did she did she bring that up? She she Yeah, well, I asked for a game for that for somebody that identifies as a man or a couple of men because I'm bi curious, okay? I'll admit that to you right now. And then she was telling well, I mean, me my, my gender. That's for everyone, sir. So but she's saying I, I, my gender doesn't matter. And then she started being racial in her tone and about my ethnicity and prejudiciary and everything. Okay, and I think as an employee, this is a disloyalist character trait. I don't think this should really stand without any sort of discipline. Now I'll yeah, accept this as an no, apology. There, there, there will there will be discipline. I I, I I I'm going to discuss with. I, she's at the very least being written up, uh, if not terminated. Um, I I I wanted. I if if gender or race was brought up remotely, there is absolutely no reason for that, and that shall be handled. Well, I think if she just apologized me on the phone, I think that would be a. I think that would be the best way to handle it. Okay, hold on one second. That's sir. all I want. You don't have to terminate her. Just put her on the phone and have her apologize. Don't worry, guys. I'll, I'll turn it around. Don't worry. I've done this before. This is Tommy. Tommy, all I want is an apology from you. That's all. Okay, I'm very sorry for how I talked to you. And for being discriminatory. And for being discriminatory. That's right. And for being prejudiciary. I'm sorry? And for being prejudiciary. You're using huge words. I don't know what they mean. Well, it sounds like you do because you're behaving that way, sir. I said sorry. Sir? Hello? Sir? Are you being discriminatory yes. too, sir? No, I'm not, sir. I, she, uh, you said that you would like her to apologize. I asked her to apologize to you. Um, she handed me back the phone. I, now I'm she, sensing that your tone... Did she apologize, sir, or did she not? She did, but now I'm sensing in your tone that you're being discriminatory as well. What kind of place is this? I, I'm not being discriminatory, sir, and I'm not using any tone. I'm using my normal speaking voice. Your, your timbre and your tone is getting more aggressive, and I'm getting a little bit worried. Sir, I, I'm not being remotely aggressive to you at all. Well, I can tell by your tone, your timbre, you're being prejudiciary, racialized, and discriminatory. Uh, I can guarantee you, sir, that I am not. Uh, I... I 
am an, I, I de- deal with an awful lot of discrimination myself. Why? And therefore operate no discriminatory practices. You're discriminating. I can, I can no, tell. No, I am not, sir. I can tell in your tone I, you're discriminating. I, I am not, sir. No, is this I a, have not said anything about anything, and I have no tone, sir. This is my normal speaking voice. I have not... I have not displayed any actions that describe what you're... I am simply trying to handle this matter. You're being micro, microaggressive and macroaggressive as well. I am not being well. microaggressive, sir. You're being I am, macroaggressive, too. I am not being aggressive too. at all. I can hear How the have mega, I been aggressive to you, sir? The mega Herschel tone of which you speak is quite racial, sir. It, it, there, I, have, I have never brought up race in this at all. Sir. Well, maybe you have a problem with my by curiosity. I do not have a problem with that, as I have a lesbian daughter, so I have no problem with that whatsoever. Sir. Well, I'm by curious, sir. It's a little different. I, I, I do not judge people based upon anything, sir. And I have not judged you no, in one way. You're not. You're, or, you're prejudiciarying me. I am not, sir. Yes, you are, sir. I can assure you I am not. I can assure you that... I am trying to figure out what is going on, sir. This sounds like a case that should be brought to the SPCC. I don't don't know. What do you think? I have not raised any tone to you, so I am still trying to, uh, you know, determine exactly... uh, you know, your pitch and depth is getting more severe by the second involving your raciality in your conversation. I have not, I have not brought race into this at all, sir. You, you continue to bring race in. This. What kind of place is this? What kind of place is this, sir? I do not understand what you're asking. I mean, sir. Do you train your employees to be discriminating? I do not, sir. I can assure you, I do not. Is Tommy your daughter? Tommy is not my daughter, sir. Okay. Tommy is my employee, and that is all. Okay. Well, I mean, whatever your relationship is, it's none of my business. Well, you just asked, so I told you that she is my employee, and that is all. Okay. Well, I think you... I, I'm, an, I'm an open and shut book, sir. I... Uh, I I, 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 what are you any, anything you have to ask, I, I I will tell you what I have to say. I'm I, <laughs> are, are you I, I sort, sort of don't have a choice. I I have you don't have I any soy. No I, I disagree just, with that. Are you bought, sir? Excuse me. Are you sorry, bi? You cut out? Are you I'm bi curious or out. bisexual? I can't tell. Uh, I I am asexual, sir. Actually, you're asexual. What? I am asexual, sir. Asexual? That what? I, how, you didn't finish your that sentence. Is, that is that is how I identify. It. I uh, I do not desire anything. But uh, why? I, 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 don't I don't think that's a real thing, sir. Questions about my sexuality, sir, and nor do you. No one should have to. Yeah, but I'm confused now. You're saying you don't have a sex or sexuality? No, everybody has one, you know. You what are you trying to say that nobody has oh, one? No, no, actually a, 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 asexual is a gender identification, sir. Asexual is a gender? Is a gender identification, yes. No, it's been excluded from the LGBT list. As of twenty seventeen, sir. Okay. Well, that's I I I, I think I you're don't on your worry own here. About things, I don't worry about things like sex, sir. So this is I can off tell. my radar. I can tell, but you, you don't. I think you're all alone here, sir. No pun intended. Well, I mean, that's 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 fine by me. That's I don't. That's fine by me, sir. So what do you what do you intend to do here today? Will you just give me a discount on my next uh, purchase there? I mean, if that's what you would like, sir, I, I, I would I would just like to resolve the matter. Yeah, 90%. Okay. Okay. Uh, I would need your name for that, sir. You have so it. It's that Raul. I you that. It's Raul, and there's an I, accent I, I, mark. Okay, make sure you write it down. I don't want you to be racial. Well, there's an accent mark. 
Okay, get your pen. Okay. And get your paper, too. you got to have a paper. Make it a post-it note, actually, so you can stick it somewhere where you don't forget. I'm ready, sir. Okay, it's Raul. Okay. And there's an accent mark on the U and the A. Okay. All right. And and your last name, sir? I'm not giving you my last name because you're going to look me up on Facebook. No, 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 uh, I'm not, sir. I can't give you a I can't give you a free menu item if I don't have your. Well, we'll knock it down. I have the, more than I have more than one Raul that that dines here, sir. Well, you, maybe you recognize me then. So you just give me the ninety percent. I said that I have more than one, sir. Yeah. Well, you you're, you're more than you're you're more than welcome to to ask for me, ask for me, and I'll make sure that you get your free menu item. Ninety percent discount. Come on. I I don't have a button for ninety percent. The only way that I would be able to do it is to give it to you complimentary, sir. Well, knock it down to eighty-eight percent, and just give me a little more. How's that? Sound? I, no, sir. The the only discounts I have in my system are a fifty percent off, and I can void the thing. That that's that I don't have any other way of. I don't have okay. a way of discounting it ninety. We'll do it. We'll do it voided. Glad, we'll do it voided. I will gladly voided. give you a free entree, sir. Every day um, I come in there. We'll do it on an ongoing basis for three to six months until I feel like it's been rectified. Okay. Sir? If that's what you feel is necessary, sir. Okay. So we'll do it every time I come in there for the next six months. We'll comp it. We'll make it comped, okay? For the next six months, sir? Yeah. I think that's a little excessive. We'll, do, we'll start with three, and then if I feel like it's been rectified and retributized, then we'll keep it that way. Okay? Okay, sir. So if next three months, if you see me in there, I want that meal comped. Well, Sir? I I look forward to your visit. Sir. Okay, put Tommy on one more time. Uh, that seems to exacerbate the situation. I just want to let her uh, know. Why would you like to? I want to let her know it's why? all going to be okay now. We're all good now, Okay. If that's what it is, that's fine. Yeah, put Hold it on. on one second. Okay. What the fuck is this? What the fuck is this place? This is Tommy. Tommy. Uh, so I don't yes. know if I just speak into your boss there and just let you know he's making it good every time uh, I come in there for the next three months. My meal's going to be comped. Some what? My meal's going to be comped when I come in there every time for the next three months just to make it good, okay? Um, okay. So just to let you know, when you see me in there, it's going to be comped. Just make sure you comp the whole tab. Um, that's fine. Just let him know your information. That way you can give it to me when you come in. Okay, and if you want to jump on that tab as well, I'm happy to get you something as well just to make it good for us, you know? Thank you. What would, what would you put on that tab? Oh, come, come on, girl. What you put on that tab? Come on. Yes, sir. Hello. Yeah, yeah she said Hello? she. Yeah, I'm here. I'm here, sir. I'm sorry. She just handed me the phone back. I. Yeah. She said she's she's gonna um, be there when I come in next time, so we're gonna like work it out together. We're gonna work out something she likes to put on my on my tab. So hope you don't mind me uh, getting an employee something as well. What do you think? Uh, well, I prefer that my employees not drink during the shift, but well, you, you um, won't know. You won't know. Forget I said anything. Oh, you won't I, know I, I find that hard to believe because I'm always here. 
So when you smell I, people's I'm breath? Sure I'll know. You get up in people's faces? What kind of manager are you? I'm, I'm not getting up in anyone's face, sir. I don't know. It sounds I'm like just, you're, you're aggressive. You're a real aggressive guy over there. I am not aggressive, sir. I'd tone it down. Just calm down, sir. Okay? Um, I, I'm very calm, sir. You're being aggressive. Stop raising your voices. Calm down. I don't appreciate it. I have not, I have not raised my voice once, sir. Okay. I'm still, I'm still speaking in the same exact tone, the same monotone that I have been the entire time. No, sir. Your timbre has increased in pitch and wavelength, and I can tell it has racial overtones and undertones. As well it, as it does not, sir, because I am in no means racist against anyone. I don't believe you, sir. And I am, I, 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 I'm not, sir, and I have not, I have not done anything to give you that impression. You're doing an impression? No, that's very racial, sir. No, no, no. I said I have not give, I have not done anything that should give off that impression. I am using my same speaking voice that I always use. Yeah, but you said you're doing and racial impressions now. That's I extremely discriminatory. I did not say that, sir. Now you are putting words in my mouth. That is not what I said. I said that I have done nothing to have given you that impression. Yeah, you said you're doing an impression of something racial. I did not say that, sir. You were putting words into my mouth. You're being that a is colonizer. Not what I said. That is not what I said. You're being a colonizer. I'm just getting so upset, I'm going to cry. Sir, I have not done anything. I apologize. Yeah? Well, I don't accept your apology unless it's in the form of a comped meal once a week for the next three months. I've already told you that I will give you that, sir. I look forward to your visit. Yeah? Okay, well, just look me up. I'm, I'm Raul, so you'll see me walking in. I'm, I'm about 6'5". I, 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 I would love to meet you, sir. I have more than one Raul that eats here, so I, okay. I do not know who you are, but and because, I, I will gladly comp you a meal. Yeah. Let's, I, I, I can't wait. I can't wait. Yeah, and because of your racial impressions, we're going to make it six I am not now. using any racial impressions, sir. You are putting words into my mouth. The more you do a racial impression, the more discriminatory you're I making yourself. I am not yourself. doing a racial impression, sir. I am not doing anything. I am using my normal speaking voice. This, so being a ra being racial is normal for you, okay? No, that no. You are again putting words into my mouth, sir. That is not what I said. That is not at all what I said. Okay. Well, I don't believe you. I think you're doing an impression right now. Um, sir. Sir, that's not what I said. So now I, I, I don't know what to say because now you were you just flat out saying lies, and I didn't slap that's anybody. Not at all what I said. You're saying I slapped somebody flat on their back? No, I said you are saying lies. You were. You... Are you calling me a liar? Sir, that, that that's not what I said. So if you're saying that I said that, then yes. Okay, so you're being discriminatory because of your racial no, impressions. No, I am not, sir. No, I am not. I, I can't have believe not you're trying to defend yourself for this. To you, sir. I apologize for your feeling. Okay. But that is not what I... I have not discriminated against you. I have not said one discriminatory thing this entire conversation. You've been discriminatory. Maybe Tommy off the has, and I'm, I can't wait to try and play back the cameras and find out. Okay. But I have not, sir. All right, we'll send. I'll come in there tomorrow night and pick up the videotape. How's that sound? Well, it's a cloud-based system, so that'll be real hard to do. Okay, what's the um, password? And I'm really hoping that the audio works. Um, what's the password? I've never had to. I've never had to look uh, anything like this up, but uh, I do want to know what she said to you on the phone very much. Okay, well, I'm, I'm I'm logging into my altitude. What's the password to get up to the cloud? Uh, sir, I'm. I'll, I want to cross-reference it. I, I, I can only look it up from my system here in the building. I, I can't, I, I don't, I don't even have the password. Well, you better look it up. I, I can't, I can't do that while on the phone with you, sir. 
Well, what's the password? Let me into the cloud. I want to cross-reference. I don't want you doctoring any videotape. I don't have a password to give you, sir. I'm not going to let you doctor your footage, sir. I'm not going to doctor any footage. I don't have the ability. That's what you tell me, but you also are doing racialized impressions. No, I am not, sir. And you're leaving a discriminatory impression on my experience. I, I, am, I am using my normal speaking voice, sir. Which is I racial. I've done one impression the entire time. You're doing tones and timbres? <laughs> sir. I am not, sir. I am using my normal speaking voice. You're doing tones and timbres of a racialized I, nature. And they're impressionary. I am not, sir. They're impressionary. Not. Down, downright they are. Downright impressionary I, I, I and downright discriminatory. I apologize for any feeling, sir. How about you call me back in the morning and we take care of this? Okay, I'll pick you up. We'll get a, get a maple bagel. How's that sound? Uh, I, I'll be here at work. You're more than welcome to come see me. Okay, how do you take your coffee? You want a black? I, I, I'm the, I don't allow outside food and drinks in my building, so... Well, you want to meet me outside? Is that a threat? No, sir, that's not a threat. I'm saying I would gladly love to see you inside the restaurant. Okay, you want to see me inside, all right. Well, you better comp that meal. Put your button on the comp button. Put your finger on the comp button. I apologize, I got a little tongue twisted there, but I'm just so appalled. Just make sure you get the comp ready, okay? And I'll bring you a coffee, I will. Uh, please don't. I don't allow outside food and drink in my establishment. It's what, against health code. What, do you want some cream or something? I'll, I'll get you cream. No, sir. No, sir. I do not. It's against health code to bring a product from another place into my establishment. Yeah, that's what you say. No, that, that, that's, that, that's, the, that's the law, sir. Well, you, you that, can't just that, take a sip. That, that is the law. You can't just let uh, me pop I, the lid off to let I'm it cool down. I'm certified in food, health, and safety. Uh, that is the law. I'm certified so. as well. And I'm recognized. And I'm notarized as well. Awesome, sir. I yeah. can't wait to meet you. Come yeah. on in. I'll pop the lid off my coffee inside just to let it cool down. I won't sip it, I promise. Uh, no, no. I, again, sir, I do not allow outside food and drink in. There, there's a large sign that says that no one can bring anything in. No outside food or drink. Just to have it cool down. What if it's raining? Just give me about two minutes. I'll pop the lid off. We can talk. I'll just let it cool down. No, no, sir. It's not about letting anything cool down. There is no outside food or beverage allowed in the building. Okay. Well, I'm going to be drinking it, so you can't stop me. Uh, well, you, you're not allowed to bring it in the building, sir. Well, you're going to see me walking inside with the coffee. I'm just going to let it cool down. I promise I won't drink it. Now, if you want some, we can, just, we can split one. Uh, no, no, sir. I, I, I would prefer you not bring coffee into my establishment. But you want a bagel? I can get you a bagel or no, orange juice. No, I or would prefer that n no outside food or beverage, as the sign says at the door. That sign. In. Well, there's no sign saying that you do racial impressions in there. Well, because no one is doing racial impressions. So I've seen it. I'm I hearing apologize. it right now. Yeah. I apologize, but I, 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 I feel that we reached a we reached an agreement on this. Sure. Um, if you would like to speak with me more about this, you're going to have to call me back tomorrow. Okay. Well, or, will you be uh, in? Or stop uh, by and see me. Okay. Well, I'll give you a call tomorrow. Will you be in between uh, seven and ten p.m. Eastern time? Uh, I, I'm here during almost all open hours. Okay. So, yes, well, I will be here from 7 to 10 tomorrow. Sure. All right. We'll speak to you then. We'll, fo we'll follow up with you. Okay? All right. Sounds great. Thank all you, Raul. All right. Goodbye.